É com muita satisfação e emoção que testemunho mais uma vez a inauguração e desta vez deste novo empreendimento turístico Ponta Mbeni Lodge. O efeito a Ponta Mbeni Lodge está inserido numa das melhores atrações turísticas do país. Trata-se, pois, de uma valorização do que melhor temos da natureza. This inauguration is a, a sign of growth of the National Park of Maputo, but not only in size and number of uh, animals, but and the, the quality of the service that uh, the park can offer. Ponta Memben is one of the points where we deposit the dream of the government to develop tourism, but tourism is accessible for everyone and for everyone. Memben is a consequence of a strategy of the last 15 years with um, a huge contribution from, from Peace Parks, not just through funding, but uh, a lot of technical support to it. We started by securing the place first, protect the place. So in the beginning, there was a lot of investment on, on security, anti-poaching, a lot of investment infrastructures also, rewilding the terrestrial part, protecting the marine. And by rewilding, uh, then wasn't the purpose of it, but then it, we became a, an attraction. You know, it's always a, a privilege and an honor to have the, the president to uh, come and inaugurate an infrastructure in a, in, in a park. Isn't it exciting to be here today to, to witness the launch of, of Membin Lodge, 80 bed lodge, and it's amongst the trees, and we didn't cut one single big tree down when we built the lodge. If you fly over it, you won't see the lodge. So that just gives you a, an idea of how well it was placed and designed to really merge in with nature and to give that feeling of coexistence in a protected area to have development and tourism, which ultimately we require to sustain the park. So we need income to manage the area. You can do it in a way that is balanced and to be able to achieve the goals of getting a sustainable protected area in the long term. It's an incredibly momentous day because it's one of the first times or the first time a peace park has invested heavily into tourism. And that tourism will obviously generate revenue for the parks. 20% of the revenue generated from this Membane Lodge facility will go to communities and they'll select what projects they want to, want to utilize it on. Not only that, does it create employment? My name is Hemba and I'm a leader. I'm very happy when the environments like this are installed. It gives a lot of opportunities to young people, not only to young people, but also to increase the tourism in our country. I'm Cecilia Abel Schmitz. It is like a housekeeping. In the case of Memben, we have to really give credit and recognition to Mr. Johan Rupert and, and the Renet Foundation and also to Mr. Hans Jörg Wies. Uh, those two individuals, together with the Common Foundation uh, that is backed by Mr. Van Anton have been instrumental in transforming Maputo National Park and of course we did that in partnership with the World Bank and in partnership with a program called MozBio. Without donors, partners supporting this initiative and believing that change is possible, fortunately we have here a, a wonderful success story. Without that support from the international donor community, we would not have been where we are today. So I see here community, government and Peace Park and other financial agencies like World Bank you know, coming together, each one with his strength, and then we're able to build uh, such a good example for the rest of the world in terms of conservation.